People have been asking me why it's not a good idea to release ducks into the wild. This is exactly why. These are domesticated white Pekin ducks and they have been bred in captivity for thousands of years. These ducks are flightless and they will never be able to learn how to fly because they're too heavy. It can be a severe problem to our ecosystem if these domesticated ducks inbreed with the mallard ducks which are wild and native here. I just missed it but this is a prime example. This male swan is trying to defect his young and it just ripped out a whole chunk of this duck's feathers because it couldn't escape. And that's exactly why we just saved them. Some random lady gave us a basket to put them in. Stay tuned for part two. This is part two of saving domesticated ducks from the wild. So I just placed them in this temporary pen and this was the basket that the lady gave us to put them in and they look a little shook. I know that they're both females because they have no curl in their tail and their quack is actually a lot louder than a male's. Now it's time to put them in the pen. Come on girls, step out. There they go. Domesticated ducks don't have the proper instincts needed to forage for all their food, so they're probably really hungry, so let's feed them. Here you go. And right away they started eating. Look how hungry they were. Ducks need water to properly swallow their food, so I decided to give them this little tray filled with water. This is part three of saving domesticated ducks from the wild. My father didn't want me to have an extra two ducks because I already have two of my own, so I'm gonna be rehoming them. I found a nice lady on Craigslist who has a flock of chickens and she wanted two ducks already. So we're gonna be bringing them to her now. I just drove an hour and a half to come here, but I'm feeling good about it. It looks really nice. Bye duckies. Enjoy your new life. Look how much room they're gonna have. This place is huge. Their new owner sent me a video and photo of them a few days later. They have some chicken friends now and once they adapt to their new environment they'll be able to free range her entire property.